We've got lots of informations here. Ooh, audio. I love audio. Third Battle of California Marine. The swarm came in from the Pacific. And I don't know if it was the local Minutemen or the Crazy 15th, but they'd set the garbage patch alight. Man, the sea was on fire. That stuff was... <laughs> the first wave of bots came in covered in burning sludge. It bought us an hour or two of slaughtering them on the beaches before the swarm recalculated. We pulled them inland, back to the Kalmar sprawl. Dropped buildings on them, EMP'd the grid. Standard operating procedure. <sighs> the last time I was in California, I was... Five, six? The light was like that vintage social net filter that was everywhere in the 40s. Log. First battle of the Eastern Seaboard Wall. Had a long run up to it. This was before Kalmar, and projections were a lot worse for the East. For three weeks, we kept getting scrambled out to some coastal burg to train Minutemen. It was always raining on account of Europe already being torched. Block after block of prefab barracks. They were still printing barracks right up until the hour the main force hit. The Minutemen? We ran combat drills with them in the streets where they'd lived, trying to pretend they might live to die somewhere else if they paid attention. Nothing worse than the ones who actually bought into it. Hopeful, pestering us with questions about Zero Dawn, like we know something they don't. I swear, the more we do this, the more like the bots we are. Except they learn from every fight. And us, I'm not so sure. Man, all these logs are very heavy. The weight of the soldiers in order just to survive. And what the frick is this Zero Dawn? Recalls, I've been instructed to remind you of Article 115 of base policy regarding unauthorized use of processor cycles. Specifically, 115C. Any holographic simulation not directly related to operational training or efficiency. Consider yourself reminded and enjoy your gaming. <laughs> enjoy your gaming. Thanks for the mails, you. Time goes fast on active duty. Four months with the wreck and recalls. I don't know, 20 drops. In and out of the West Coast, fighting with these civilian enlistees, scrappy guys and gals. Their training is basically, here's a DEW, when you see a bot, hit it. <laughs> but somehow it's all coming together. Between us and the sick MRB, we took down a horse at Lithium Beach. Pulled out before its buddies arrived, but to see a big one go down. I hope you made the news, honey. Showed everyone we're gonna have a shot at turning this around. We just need to give Project Zero Dawn the time it needs. And everything will be the way it used to be. Man, everyone's relying on this Project Zero Dawn. Oh man, I'm getting excited. I know it's been days, honey. I'm so sorry. Deployments are uh, getting real long and tougher every time. The swarm is getting better at predicting us. Less of us now, and we have to put in ten times the work for everyone gone. Like a family business on hard times, only... This isn't my family. It's not with you. I still try to see you. The life we had, in the eyes of the people out there. I remember when they were glad to see us. When they still had hope. It all seems to be slipping away. I don't even recognize the places we're defending. The only thing I know I'm still fighting for is you. Is Zero Dawn to turn this around? Or whatever the hell that is. Man, it's like freaking Matrix, all the machines. It's so terrifying that machines would someday overrun us.
Last night we got talking about D-Day 55. I was a kid then, only a few years out of boot camp. All automated now. We're last cycle stack out like the old net. Okay, that's the elevator. Doesn't seem to work. Man, this goes deep down. Okay, where the heck are we going? Examine the door. Uh, restore power. These wires must run to the power source. Whatever power this door should be close by. Can I make it? A holographic interface. There must be some kind of code. Oh man, I hate codes. Objects in this area. Ah, here. Is that it? Oh, that's an elevator. Frick, I hate codes. What the frick? Oh, there's one code here. This it, man. I hate this shite. I'm so dumb at this. Useful information. Ah, here. Ah, uh, that's up, up, down, down. Nice. I get it. I get it. Hey, y'all wanted to know how I remember the geotherm system reboot? Goes like this. Bird flies north in summer, east in spring, west in fall, and south in winter. Didn't expect to hear nature poetry from the lips of Mike the GT tech now, did you? As usual, I defy expectations. Okay, he said about north, east, west, and south. So let's do this. North, east, west, and south. Okay, that's not it so let's go north east uh, west and south still not it hey y'all wanted to know how i remember the geotherm system reboot goes like this Bird flies north in summer, east in spring, west in fall, and south in winter. 
Didn't expect to hear nature's poetry from the lips of Mike the GT Tech now, did you? As usual, I defy expectations. Oh, frick, stupid. No, it is right. He said about north. Oh, no, east. There, frick. So stupid, man. Okay, one more. So that's up, down, left, right. Oh, nice, freaking nice power cell. Another power cell. I only need one more to get to that ancient armor I found. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna get that armor. That's them, all right. They're not looking for answers, just weapons. Oh, shit, there's lots of them. Okay, how do I do this? I need to kill this guy here. Okay, just stay there. Whew.
Okay, that kills. You got anything better to do? I got a dead body over here. I really need to kill just this uh can breathe again. Nothing there. Huh? Yeah. Rock is very, very useful. Come on. Headshot. Okay, we've got three more left. Not sure if we can one hit this guy. Let's try. Nope. Woo! Ah. Now that was stealth. Anything useful here? Supply crate. Elite Punisher. That's a cultist thug. Cultist sniper. Yep. Should have brought a cart. Oh shit! Damn, I thought I was gonna die there, frick.
Oh, what's what's this place? Thanks for the mails, you. Time goes fast in active duty. Four months with the wreck and recalls. Fighting with these civilian enlistees. Scrappy guys and gals. That's all coming together. Between us and the 6th MRB, we took down a horse. I hope you made the news, honey. Show everyone we're turning this around. We just need to give Project Zero Dawn the time it needs. Well, if it's already finished. I know it's been days, honey. I'm so sorry. Deployments, sir. Uh, yeah, this is also wrong. finished. We have to put him to work for everyone. Like a status report. Ninth Mechanized Response Brigade, Commanding Officer Lieutenant Fiona Morrell. Unit morale continues to be adversely impacted by outbound engagements against the Pharaoh Plague. Especially when said engagements occur in sectors where civilian guard enlistees have been heavily engaged. The scope and nature of fatalities suffered by civilian guard and unarmed civilians in these sectors defy description. And witnessing it is generating a pervasive sense of hopelessness in the unit. Accordingly, I once again request that deployments of the 9th MRB be temporarily refocused on facilities that are mission critical to Project Zero Dawn. And once again, I request an immediate update on the status of Project Zero Dawn's timeline. I'm thinking they didn't finish the Project Zero Dawn. I think so. Rejected. I don't even know if you're alive anymore. The mails I get from you, they say they're from you, but they don't sound... They sound recycled. Phrases put together, and you don't say anything about the news I pass on. The containment zone, the rebreathers, the rioting, one earth. What happened in the Dallas bubble aims, that wasn't the robots. They won't even give me a straight answer when I demand to know if you're still alive. They just say if your messages keep coming then, you're still operational. It's not fair, Ames. It's not fair that you won't be with me when the lights go out. I love you. That's so sad. Ames, I know I mail you too much. I'm just proud of what you're doing. Everyone back home is. We got moved inland 10 kilometers, just as a precaution, they say. School's still in se- School's still in session, so I get to keep my eye on Andreas and Reggie. We never know where or when you're fighting, but when the VTOLs go over, all the kids run out and wave. I believe in you. I know nothing's ever gonna be the same, but I believe in you. I believe in us. Uh, use the console. <laughs> Before that, we'll explore first. Supplies. Already. Thank you. Got one. Audio log. Oh no. URC Operation Kickback. Reno, Nevada. Civilian guard and armor battalion skirmished. Rear guard action against the eastern seaboard swarms. Oh man, overrun and detonate. Damn. The Titan uh, res resupplying the eastern seaboard. 2200 with the elimination of the Titan. Note that this is the ninth. Uh, I think the Titans are the ones uh, producing the machines. Because it says here that this is the third Titan kill. I wonder if we can fight a Titan. That would be so awesome. What is this? 
that? It's a map. A map of what? Our world. The planet Earth, Aloy. It's not flat like you thought. Why would I think that? During eclipses, the shadow cast on the moon is curved. So our world is a globe. And it looks like this, from a distance. We'll discuss this another time. Back to the matter at hand. The Faro robots were spreading across the world, eating everything up. Somehow, Elizabeth stopped them before it was too late. But how? Yeah, I wondered about that, Aloy. How? Anything here? Nope. Ah, oh, that's the Titan. It is like freaking crisis. That's one big mother F. The eclipse. Tampering with the metal devil. They don't think they can wake it, do they? Damn, just look at that. Watch out! Whoa. Oh man, a death bringer. Ah, oh, Metal Gear again. Another Kobish, and this one can move. Holy shit! It <laughs> is so freaking awesome. Just freaking look at that. 